Maya is taking her morning preparations very seriously this morning, playing with some makeup. Today's a big day, isn't it, Maya, for a couple of reasons. You wanna tell us what, why it's a big day? Why is it so important? It's your birthday. It's my birthday, and there's something else that's been really important about today, you remember? Addie's first day of school. That's right. Addie starts her first day at her new school out here in Tennessee. She's going to be in second grade. Maya doesn't start until next week. The kindergartners are a week behind. We met two kids yesterday at a back to school event that had Addie's teacher last year and they said she was the nicest teacher and that she looked like a celebrity. Addie, who does your teacher look like? Taylor Swift. Yep. Yesterday we went to a back to school event for the girls. It was just for new families who are new to the school. We met a couple kids from Addie's class, so she'll know a couple girls today, won't she? We didn't meet any from your class, did we? No kindergartners, but that's okay. We'll meet some soon. Addie put a lot of thought into picking out her first day of school outfit. Hi, Maya. I got a new shirt that these are the types of sleeves that I like and pants for these pockets are here and then new shoes. And then I chose a choker to wear, my Arizona bracelet, and the Breedtastic bracelet I made. I love you. I know you're gonna have a super day at school. I love you so much. It's gonna be the best day ever. And I'll be here when you get home. Okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Done. I can't believe she's going to second grade! You ready? Yeah. Let's go then! I'm excited. All right, off we go to second grade! So the school that the girls are going to now have a bus system, and we've never had a bus system at our schools in the past, and the girls are really, really, really wanting Try the buses. Addie wanted to ride it on the first morning today, but I told her I have to take you to your first morning and I walk you into your classroom and see your teacher and see your desk and do all that. But we told her that she could ride the bus home from school the first day if she really wanted to. Are you sure you want to do that? Yeah. Addie, you're getting too big. I want to ride the bus. So I'm a little bit nervous about that, but she's super excited. We've gone over the bus number. I have it written on her lunch box and I'm sure she'll be just fine. I'm gonna be outside probably half an hour before the bus even arrives just waiting for her. Why do you wanna ride the bus so badly? I don't know. I've just never been on a bus by myself. How are you feeling now, Addie? Are you excited? Are you a little nervous? I'm both. You're both? That's okay, that's normal to be both. Well, we did it. We just dropped her off and she did really well. She went right inside. Her teacher seems so nice and friendly. She got on her desk. I think it's gonna be a really good day. Now I just have to get through the rest of the day and I just, I wanna get her home and hear all about it and hopefully everything goes wonderfully. Think she's gonna do well? I think she's gonna do wonderfully. I think she will too. <laughs> As they have to get school today, so we're just trying to kill a few hours, get the house picked up a little bit, then the kids play, and then before we know it, she should be home, and I can't wait to hear how her first day went. today so we're gonna start heading to the bus stop where we can greet her getting off the bus for the first time at her new school. <laughs> Was that fun Colin? Was that fun? Let's go get Addie, come on! We gotta go get Addie! Sandy, have you missed Addie today? Have you missed your big sissy? We'll get her soon. We're laughing because we feel like Addie has like a giant greeting committee for her first day from school. We've got her mom and dad here. We've got Colin. 
and then grandma and grandpa are in town visiting coming to say hi Maya's here and of course Sandy do we have a welcome home banner Lucy? <laughs> <laughs> and a band yeah, yeah. yeah. a <laughs> band to greet Addie <laughs> we're all a little excited about Addie's first day you can tell What's your favorite thing about today? Um, I know. What? I have lots of papers to sign. I have papers to sign? Yep. Oh, goody. And I have one little simple thing of homework. Oh, you do? Yeah. So, did you make any new friends today? Yeah. Who? Addison. Oh, how fun. Has a name kind of like you. Yeah, she was, she was on the same bus as me. Oh, she was? Did yeah. you sit by her? Yeah. Oh, how cool. Abby, what kind of things do you do at school today? We went on the playground. And how was the playground? Good. We put the papers in here for you to sign. Oh. And we had our snack. Okay. And we did a work session in the morning. And yeah. Did you love it? Yeah. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Go to the show. Go to Moose, a toy company behind some of your favorite toys, most likely like Shopkins and Scruffle Loves and Pick Me Pops, sent us this giant door behind me for Disney Dorables, and I believe there are some fun toys hidden inside that Addie and Maya are going to check out. Disney Dorables. Behind every door is surprises in store. That's right, and up here it tells us there are 78 to collect in Series One, and we haven't even seen Series Two or Series Three or anything beyond that, so. I'm excited to see what's behind these doors. Disney Dorables unlock our latest surprise with glittering eyes. So there are a bunch of numbered like mini doors on this big door, so I'm guessing we probably open them in order starting with number one. Why don't you open door number one? Ooh, what's in here? Oh my goodness. Who did you get, Maya? I got this law. This is Wendy from Peter Pan, Maya. Let's see what I get. Ooh, it's Peter Pan. One of the things I love about these Disney Dorables is that you can collect these little figures from so many different Disney movies. Let me show you a few of them just by looking at the collector's guide. It's such a great variety. We've got some limited edition, Winnie the Pooh, Monsters Inc., Alice in Wonderland, and of course, we have common, rare, ultra rare, limited edition, and special edition to collect. She's an ultra rare. Is she? Yeah, I see How it. cool. Okay, go. <gasps> what is this? Candy. Candy, 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 candy. Oh my candy, goodness. Candy, candy. Wait, goldfish, jelly beans. And more, more jelly, beans. Beans. jelly beans. Oh, I get a candy necklace too, or bracelet. I'm in my jelly beans. I think it's time for door number three. Hope pirate ship. We have Mickey's house. I love how glittery Mickey's house is. Is that Pluto's house? It sure is. Ooh, who is this? Pinocchio. Let me see. Oh, Mickey Mouse. One of the things that I love about Disney Dorables is that you can mix and match all the little Dorable doors to make almost like a Disney Dorable village. It's really, really cute. We saw a giant display when we were at VidCon and it filled like an entire wall with just Dorable doors on top of each other. So I thought that'd be so cool to do. So at least we can do a smaller version of that now that we have all of these. So here is Rapunzel's Alice, right? This Anna's. looks like, yep, that looks like Anna's. This is the one we don't know, Mickey Mouse. This looks like Monsters, Inc., right? I don't know what this is, though. And then Rapunzel down here. <gasps> Whoa, these are big sets. Oh, it's a door number six. Oh. <laughs> oh my. 
goodness, girl. I think they saved the best for last. This one looks pretty cool. I think they're just a little bit excited to get this last one open. It is pretty cool, I have to admit. Well, the girls have successfully opened all six doors and they are now playing with all the new Disney Dorables. I think it's gonna keep them busy for quite a while. And while they're busy putting all their Dorables together and making all sorts of cute Disney Dorable worlds, I'm gonna go get myself ready because in just a few minutes, I guess in about an hour, we're gonna head out for a birthday celebration. We're gonna go to the Grand Ole Opry and see a little bit of a concert tonight. and they have this famous mural here that says that we believe in Nashville and there's usually a long line of people to take a picture by it. And today there wasn't that much of a line so we figured we might as well grab one while we have a chance. We've got a little time to kill before the show starts so we're browsing the gift shop for some fun country goods. Look at that. Oh. Loving some sweet country music. Girlies, who are we seeing at the Grand Ole Opry? Carrie Underwood. Are you super, super excited? Yes. Did you love Carrie Underwood? Yeah. What was your favorite song that she sang? Um, Blown Away. <laughs> Blown Away? That was pretty cool. Sadly, Maya fell asleep probably about a half hour before Carrie Underwood came out and she slept through the entire thing. I tried to wake her up and jiggle her let her know that she was here, but she just conked right back out on me. Okay, we have been walking on the parking lot for probably 15 nice minutes now, yeah. 20 minutes, and we cannot find our car. Like we don't remember where we parked it. This parking lot is ginormous. We're pressing the horn to honk for it. And it is nowhere in sight. We're gonna be here all night long. <laughs> My dad's out looking somewhere too. And now I don't, oh, he's over there. I thought we lost him, but he's over there. I guarantee you we're like over that way. Where we were like trying to find. So we may not even be in the right like wing of the park. <laughs> Luckily we're having a pretty good sense of humor about this. There are probably about 10 other people lost in the parking lot right now and everybody's pressing the button on their key to honk their horns and so we think we hear our car. We run over to the honking horn car and it's someone else's car. Over there. He was the driver. That's true. And he's responsible for this. <laughs> he's the one who parked. You're responsible for this. <laughs> Wait, Dad found it? Dad found it? Yay, my dad found it. Let's see. Okay, we're looking. Now we have to find my dad. <laughs> this place needs markers. Why well, can't we be like Disneyland? We have the Donald Duck parking lot, the Goofy parking lot. At least walk. numbers. Like, At least numbers. Row one. <laughs> row two. That would be helpful. <laughs> it's right down here. <laughs> been 40 minutes walking through a parking lot. We found our car and we are checking out for the night. Thank you for watching Tic Tac Toy Family. Be sure to check out Tic Tac Toy. We'll see you next time.